So we were thinking about water bottles and what we don't like, and so our problem, our main problem is that we hate how the bottle mouth is either too big, too small, too drippy, or it's too hard to open for all of us who are trying to bring water, you know, to school or something like that. And so we came up with, that came from a bunch of different problems that we brainstormed. Um, yeah, so actually, well, I guess I'll talk more about like some other things before how it led up to this. Um, so like we were just talking about like, oh, the problem magnified minute by like there's the big mouth or the small, it's like the sport um, top, but like neither of those work because like with this one you splash on yourself and this one like is just you can't get enough water out. And so then we're talking about how like people can drink out of cups, but like they just can't handle water bottles. So like, oh, maybe we could somehow do like a cup, but then like have a Tupperware lid and it turned into this whole like flip switch spring loaded lid or like until it just seal, seal the new one open. And that eventually like for the cost one, we started thinking about like IV and like an integrated like water into you. Right. Um, so, right. so we went from an external solution to more an integrated solution. Um, this was, sorry, this is Elizabeth's idea if you want to talk more about it. But, um, you just you're hooked up to an IV that constantly hydrates you throughout the day, so you don't have to think about it. And so that would be an easy interface because there's no and easy on time because you never have to make an effort. Um, and so one of the ones we magnify time. We have forever to fix this problem. <laughs> evolve, evolve. So you can eat and drink as much water. Camel yeah. 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 I love it. Um, so uh, one of the interface, minify like the most basic interface would be to drink rainwater when you're walking around, for example. Um, <laughs> but it, it gets all over. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Um, so we kind of moved to this final product that you mm -hmm. want to start. Yeah. On? The, so the idea behind is it's like a, a sleeve that you that you might put in a um, in a bag. You know these sleeves that hold computers. So fairly narrow and like an eight by eleven sheet, eight and a half by eleven, and it's something like a camel pack. Um, that getting toward it sort of lies along that continuum of something external to your body versus something integrated to your body. So it would sit, you know, if if it's in your pack, it would sit in the pack and it would. You could, you know, you wouldn't absorb it. We are we aren't getting too absorbed yet, but you, there would be a. Um, <laughs> Extendable. An extendable, retractable like thing. Like a straw that you, A straw. So you drink out of it when you need to and then it would retract. So you'd have to open your mouth and <laughs> let it retract um, and go back inside its little spot. But the other part of it is that there'd be watering holes or what were you calling them? They're almost like gas stations, stations. where you fill up. Yeah. If yeah. you felt like throughout the day you were heavy into sports activities or wanting more water, needing more water. This would hold one liter of water, by the way. Yeah. Um, you could go, you want to talk about that? <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, so we found that it, the pack, just based on like an eight and a half by 11 sheet of paper that's about, you know, two centimeters deep would give us about a liter of water, which is fairly, which is definitely enough water to last you throughout the day. But if you were having to refill, you could use, it would have a little, uh, a like a seal, like a nozzle type thing like they have on air tools. Where they, it's you know, it's, it's a perfect seal, but it then is pressure driven, so you can just pop it straight off, and you'd have a pressurized dispenser, so that it could fill it rather quickly, and then. Um, how you heavy know, would it be? How heavy would this well, be? About yeah. It'd be the same as like your like. Water. Oh, just a liter of water. Okay. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. I mean, like you know, we can use some like thin so plastic or thin pounds, rubber, right? so the um, the packaging wouldn't really take up any weight. Yeah. It'd just be the water, pretty much. Yeah. Cool. So. And then you, you could have one of these at home just because you only refill it once a day, right? Yeah. I mean, but then, you know, they might have those around buildings or something. Sweet. I, I need one of those right now. Good job, Brad. <laughs> <laughs>